moving on to entertainment. If you've been keeping up with the last couple of weeks, uh, Kevin and I have, Kevin and I, we've been talking about movie trailers and things we want to see. And there's a couple others that have dropped either in these past two weeks or recently. I'm going to talk about uh, at least three of them here. One I just saw today, the Morbius trailer drop. And that movie looks good. Uh, anybody you, anybody that's not familiar with Morbius, it is one of the Marvel... Um, he, he's an anti-hero slash villain, one of those types. Vampire. Uh, extremely powerful and he's one of Spider-Man's foes I don't believe that Spider-Man will be in this movie at all but from what I've seen from the uh, trailer that dropped today this movie looks damn good let me tell you what it's coming out in late December I think the 29th the uh, trailer for the Book of Boba Fett dropped a couple days ago. Man, oh man. I will park in front of the TV every Thursday whenever that show drops, and I'll be there every week, and I will make sure that I... I'll probably talk about it on this show because we all know that Kevin... Kevin hasn't even watched the full first and second season of The Mandalorian yet, so he's way behind. So, leave some comments and rub it in. Tell Kevin that he needs to get off his hoo-ha and um, watch The Mandalorian. Man up, boy. Watch the show. Anyway, I'm going to be watching The Book of Boba Fett. That was an awesome trailer. It, uh, it doesn't give anything away, but it lets you know that you're going to be in for a ride. And it's that same style as The Mandalorian, too, so I know that they are going to really bring it. I've liked what uh, Disney's done with these last couple of Star Wars shows on TV, and they're on the way back uh, to redeeming themselves from dropping the ball in that last Star Wars movie. And make no mistake about it, I am a huge Star Wars fan and always have been, always will be. But as much as I like the last Star Wars movie, I didn't like the result that we got. Star Wars could have been so much better if it were just a little bit cohesive. But that's another story for another time. And last but not least, I'm getting ready to go back to the 80s. Uh, Sylvester Stallone has been in the uh, editing room. As you know, he directed Rocky IV. So he is putting out Rocky versus Drago. It's the uh, Rocky IV director's cut. First of all, if you never saw Rocky IV, something is wrong with you. If you have seen it, you got to check out the director's cut. There's going to be um, several minutes of added footage with reworked footage. And I believe from just the little snippets that he's put out on his Instagram page and then the little YouTube trailer that I saw, this movie's going to be great. Now, remember, Kevin's the DJ, I'm the movie guy. So if I say that a movie's gonna be good, trust me, the movie's gonna be good. Thank you, thank you. 